I think that uh, the next mayor has to be uh, an unusual combination of both the capacity to manage the business of the city, the job of uh, policing, fire, pick up the trash, clean the streets, maintain the public spaces, but while doing that to have and be able to communicate a vision, a future, a direction that we can all buy in on and, and, and follow. Uh, I had the opportunity of working for four mayors, uh, starting with Richardson Dilworth and uh, through uh, Mayor Green, and I'd, I'd pick the best quality of each of them and say, I'd like to see that and clone that to the next uh, mayor. I, I see the problem as a problem of leadership. And our leadership has to be the ones responsible. If you see areas of the city that are, that are in need, that's where you need to direct more of your resources to. And we have elected leaders who don't always do that. And our leader, the next mayor has to be someone who can see these, see these uh, areas and direct the resources to them. And along with the mayor comes city council. And you know what, if they're not doing it, and we as people keep reelecting these people into office, then we're the ones to blame. It's not the mayor's fault. It's not city council's fault. Why do we keep electing someone who's not gonna address the major problems of the, in this city? then we have nothing to complain about except for ourselves. I have been frustrated in that it's difficult to hold candidates accountable, mm -hmm. that it's very difficult to really find beyond the rhetoric what their issue statement mm -hmm. is and their inclusivity is. So I think part of it is to figure out a structure for the campaign mm -hmm. where we can hold them accountable for what they plan. Yeah. You know, just mm -hmm. like the former president, you know, David Adamani at Temple. I mean, when he came to Temple, he wrote out exactly what his goals were and what he had hoped to perform. I mean, all of us have job descriptions. All of us get called in by our bosses. Maybe even our salaries are dependent upon those job descriptions. <laughs> Yet in politics, not really a big job description. Nobody sits down with them every quarter like we sit down with, and, and their check still comes no matter what happens.